When you open SimRides 2, you will be taken to the launcher screen. From here, you can choose to write a document, use an existing environment, or design a new environment for a student to use. You can also choose the type of interface displayed when accessing these features. So if I click the Change button down here, I'm given the option to choose between three preset interfaces. If I select the full toolbars option, and then click OK, and then choose to write a document, it will allow me access to all of the toolbars. So on here, I've got all of the various text formatting tools, the alignment tools, the symbol formatting tools, and I can choose basic things like printing, saving, opening and existing documents, and creating a new document. I can also choose to return to the launcher, so if I click this icon here, it will take us back to the launcher screen. And if I select a different interface option, so this time if I select the environment toolbars and choose to open an existing environment, you will notice a lot less displayed on the toolbars. So this is a more basic interface and it's really been designed for users who wish to simply author a document using an environment. Uh, this toolbar could be useful for a switch user or someone who is not that confident with writing. So it's a more basic interface. So if I go back to the launcher screen and choose the final interface, the writing toolbars interface, and again if I choose to write a document you'll notice that this interface is kind of between the two it's a more varied interface than the environment toolbars but not as extensive as the full toolbars so this is kind of aimed at users who want to author a document with or without an environment if I go back to the launcher you can also access a variety of support materials so if I click on help and tutorials you can access the product manual PDF help sheets and a tutorial environment. There's also a link to the tech support section on the widget website.